The geckos in New Caledonia are technically of Australian origin. Now that's a really strange statement to make, but the reality is far crazier. In 2016, a study was published in the Journal of Biogeography that investigated the origin of the geckos of New Caledonia. But did they get there or were they already there? The islands of New Caledonia and New Zealand are the emergence points of the half-submerged continent Zealandia. The study's aim was to find out if the geckos were already living on Zealandia before sea levels rose and reduce the landmass to what remains today as the islands of New Caledonia, or if the geckos arrived after. Through studying mitochondrial DNA, they could track maternal ancestry back thousands of years and work out how lineages diverged. Their data showed there was a common ancestor of all of the geckos of New Caledonia and the geckos in the Australian genus, Pseudothacodactylus. An unknown species diverged and found its way to New Caledonia. It's likely that these geckos rafted from their Australian origin to New Caledonia because their diverged Divergence was as recent as 15 million years ago, a whopping 22 million years after New Caledonia emerged from the sea, meaning they arrived after the islands emerged. The branches of the New Caledonian clade are short, indicating rapid speciation as geckos exploited new niches before declining towards the present. Beleps and the Isle of Pines were intermittently connected to the mainland via narrow land bridges during the Pleistocene. The geckos on these islands got there either by rafting or via the land bridges from the mainland. The loyalties were not emergent until after the Pleistocene, and their geckos are likely to have got there via rafting alone. This just shows how special the geckos of New Caledonia are, so the next time you're looking at one of these geckos, think about the incredible journey they went through to be what they are today.